Transwest Truck Trailer RV. We're in beautiful Federal, Colorado. It's yours truly, Marlon Bledman. And I'm proud to show you guys a 2019 Ram 3500. This one is the long box. It is a big horn. And we're gonna show you some of the features on here. Also, previous owner did add a few upgrades. So we're gonna show you that as well. There's so much you could do if you pick up. And this is just a touch of what you could do with a pickup behind me. We also hook up to this trailer, this Logan trailer. And if you guys, uh, you guys know that Transwest is a truck trailer RV location. So if you wanna hook up a trailer and a truck, full combo, we also do stuff like that. We've done that for many years now. So this is ready to go if you wanna come pick it up today. <laughs> uh, just, just for thought. Uh, so let's go over this uh, 2019 Ram 3500 Big Horn Crew Cab Long Bed 4x4. Straight off the bat, you guys could see aftermarket rims and tires. That's one good thing I want to show you guys. Of course, that just lifts the truck up a little bit. You're looking at 295 70 R18s, and those are the XD all black rims. Leveling kit was done on this unit, so you can see this truck is kind of leveled if you take a good look at it normally you have the the nose of the truck a little bit lower down but he did put a leveling kit on here aftermarket running boards and those are the step version so you have the single step going in and out of the truck this one does have the 360 camera and what that means you got four cameras on all four points of this truck one up front we got one on either side underneath the towing mirrors and one in the rear. And I'll show you guys where each one is located. So one of the cameras are located right under here. Tow mirrors. You can flip this when having a trailer. This one also come equipped with blind spot monitor. And that little triangle here will light up orange when someone is in your left or right blind spot. This is the 3500, so you have that 3500 heavy duty stamp on the hood of that. Of course, it does come with the Cummins turbo diesel engine. Fender flares over all four tires. And this truck is a single wheel, so you will find just two tires in the back, not four like the Dooley's. What you guys are looking at right now is a 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel engine. And it's also partnered with a six speed automatic transmission. You're looking at 370 horsepower, 850 foot pounds of torque. This engine only has 15,000 miles, 15,000 miles for 2019. So again, you got tons of life on this unit. One owner, clean Carfax, and of course with 15,000 miles, a lot could happen of course, accidents, damages and all that stuff, but this one is super clean. Ram LED headlights, also come with fog lights as well, front and rear sensors, front camera, and it's located right underneath the A of the Ram sign or logo. We got a little uh, bull guard here. As we come around, this is the second camera underneath the right side, tow mirrors. I'm gonna check out the passenger seat. Right underneath the passenger seat, you will find your jack. All you got to do is just pull this out and your jack is located underneath the seat. And yes, guys, this, will, this was meant to, to do that. It does have that pull sign right here. Manually adjusted passenger seat. Nice little storage box here with a nice LED light. So at nighttime, when you open this box, you will have a light in here to show you what inside here does have the big horn logo 
underneath here this one does have a light as well for your glove compartment all your manuals for the vehicle and your lock for your tires it is cloth seats as you guys can see great condition when you enter this vehicle it still smells like a brand new unit underneath the seat you have the flat surface to be able to put items over here because we have a little storage box underneath the seat the floor is not level so having this just makes it easy a subwoofer underneath here with your amplifier all weather tech mats and of course you have your regular mats underneath as well underneath here you got a storage box and this is removable so you could actually pull this out fill it with whatever items once you reach that full spot that's where you stop and then you could just lay it back in here and I always tell people like if you're traveling you actually put some ice and some drinks in here it would take a few cans or, or a few bottles of water and of course it will stay in there and not spill but there's so many things you could do I normally put my tie downs in my extra storage compartments for my for the bed of the truck but again there's so many different options as we hear let's check the center between the two seats we got a few charging options USB 110 so tons, tons of charging for your passengers we got two cup holders down here two up here so you got a total of six cup holders for your passengers two up here two down here and two up here we got speakers just above the ceiling As we take a look on the bed of the truck, we got a big toolbox here. And again, you could always also replace this with a auxiliary tank. If you guys are looking to take longer trips and you need an auxiliary tank, you could actually remove this and put an auxiliary tank. But if you want to use this, this is a full storage box from the bottom to top. We do have a gooseneck hookup right now for this trailer. We could also turn this into a fifth wheel hookup. We do have fifth wheel in stock. Um, our parts department can provide the, the correct hitch for that fifth wheel turnover. Because of the video, we only just put the ball, but they do have tie downs for your chains. Fully bed lined. Like I said, it does have gooseneck and fifth wheel pre hookup for your trailers does have a seven pin and also we have lights for the bed there is a switch right below that light and you could turn it on from the back of the truck so you don't have to go all the way inside to turn those lights on there's a switch right there you could turn it on and off does have a camera right above that little window and that camera will give you the view when you're hooking up into your trailer Going on to the back end. This one does come with rear air suspension. So you do have airbags on your rear suspension. You do have a backup camera. Your ram sign coming down here. You have your four pin and seven pin hookup for your bumper pool trailer. And of course your hitch. Rear sensors. It is a four by four, so you have that stamp. It's just such an awesome unit. Let's take a look inside with some of the features on here. Again, if you guys are interested, this truck is still available. And as we enter into this awesome smelling unit, 
<laughs> like I tell you, it's only at 15,000 miles, but it still smells like a brand new unit. You do have a sunroof. As we come down, you got your shade for your sunroof as well. You got your light options if you want to turn on your light to read or if you want to have it open or turn off. The center is when you open the doors, it will turn on. Once you close the doors, it will shut off in a couple seconds. And then if you want to turn it on and have it on throughout the whole trip, that's your switch here. So center is if the door opens. Coming down, we got all your options for your sunroof and your rear window. A nice glass holder, rear view mirror, garage controls, universal garage controls. Nice little storage box here with a 12 volt hookup. Full Alpine speakers, so you got three up front here. You got two in the roof, you got all on the doors. I think we have a total of 16 speakers. Yeah, it's kind of crazy, but I love great sound when it comes to driving long distances in a vehicle. If it doesn't have great sound, I would put great sound in it, but a lot of those newer trucks come with really, really good sound and the Alpine sound system on the Ram are pretty amazing. Push to start. We got a nice touch screen here that will load up in a bit. It does come with Uconnect. So you can subscribe to the features. It will provide you with Wi-Fi on the go, emergency. If you need, if you're in an accident, it will locate you where you are, send police or ambulance your way, fire. If you broke if you broke down on the side of the road, you could actually talk to an agent as well. They'll send you a tow truck. There's so many different options when it comes to Uconnect. This one doesn't come with navigation. So with Uconnect and whatever subscription you have, you could call for directions and they'll send it straight to the vehicle. If you have a smartphone, Apple or Android, you could connect to your USB and your phone will automatically show up on the screen. Apple shows have a limited amount of apps that will show up on the screen, but your navigation, all your music apps will show up. Of course, your text messages, WhatsApp messages will show up. You will not see wording, Siri will actually read those messages to you and via voice control you could respond to whoever is texting you. As you can see on the screen right now we have heated seats for the driver and passenger. You have heated steering wheel. You could actually access your surround camera by just pushing this button. It gives you a ton of options and views that you have available. So this is the 360 camera, so you can see all around that truck. This is your bumper pool. This is your bumper pool view only. This is the front camera view only. So if you're trying to be as close to somebody as possible, you can use that camera and you can see how close you are to that object or person. And you can see your full 60 um, view and your front view and of course this is the view for your bed and you can see this line coming straight across here this is if you're lining up your trailer and you're alone this is a guide to guide you to your trailer either your fifth wheel or gooseneck when it comes to your stereo you have AM and FM radio satellite radio you do have Bluetooth technology, so you could plug in your phone via Bluetooth, play all your stuff on your phone, all your music. You could do your climate control via touchscreen, or you could do it down here manually. You have your options here to turn your heated seats on or your heated steering wheel. So these two are the same. 
Of course, the cargo light, we went through that a while ago. That's just a shortcut to get to that. And of course, your settings for everything else, display unit, voice clock, safety assistance, all the good stuff. Down here, you have your four by four options. Right now, we're in two wheel drive. But when you need your four high or four low, these are your switches right here. Push the start button. This is to change your gears. Steering wheel, behind the steering wheel on the right hand side, or where your right hand will be holding, you have your volume controls. Where your left hand is, right behind there, you have controls to change the station, change your music, whatever the case may be. Um, if you want to change from FM radio to AM radio or to satellite radio, there is a button behind there as well. So that would just keep your eyes Focus on the road and not on your on your screen. You got all your options here to toggle through your dashboard. Down here, you got your cruise control, and of course, you got your gears if you want to put it in. If you want to change gears uh, manually, you could do it down here. Right on the left hand side, down you have your, your light options on your door, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. This one does come with folding mirrors as well. And that can be very handy when you are parked in a tight spot and you don't want nobody messing with your mirrors. Because on the 3500s, those mirrors are a little bit wider or longer. So people tend to hit those mirrors very often. So this is a nice little feature to have. Again, only 15,000 miles. Tons of room here for charging again. We got a 110 plug in here. Similar to the back, you have your USB and phantom power plug-in. Phone holders, so you could actually put your phone in here while you're driving, it will not shift. Right underneath here, if you want to pull, put the charger in here, this, there's a little space here to have the charger run through there. So you could actually sit two phones while they're charging. Storage, cup holders, more storage, hand rests, more storage. So, many options here. It's a 2019 Ram 3500 Big Horn Crew Cab 4x4. This one is a long bed, single wheel. If you guys are interested in this unit, feel free today. Give me a call. Come out, test drive. We've been having some great weather here in Colorado. Um, I don't want to jinx it, but I haven't had an inch of snow yet. So let's enjoy the weather as it lasts. But in the meantime, give me a call, 303-684. 3412, cell number, text, call 661-755-4344. You guys could also email me at marlin.bledman at transwest.com. I want to thank you guys for tuning in today. I'll be with you guys tomorrow. I'm so excited that we're getting our new Freightliners in. We have one more 2021 coming in, and then our 22s will be here. So if our one that's here is ready for video, I'll try to shoot that one tomorrow. Kind of show you guys what it looks like but if not soon from now we'll be presenting you guys with our new redesign summit hall or conversions right here at transwest in frederick so thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you guys tomorrow for another video and enjoy the rest of your week thank you very much